Hi there, this is Julie Larson. In this video, I'm going to show you how to forward an email from your GoDaddy account. So, I am logged into a GoDaddy reseller account by the name of UnlimitedMobileDomains.com. Yours will probably say just say GoDaddy up there if you're not using uh, someone's reseller account. So, once you're logged in, you're going to see this screen. You're going to go over to email, click on the plus sign, go down to the free forwarding, click on setup, and up here in this drop down I'm going to do the free with domain email forwarding, and then I'm going to choose the domain name that I'm going to use to forward, MinnesotaInsuranceSolutions.com. Now that site is not hosted anywhere, it's just parked at GoDaddy. I don't intend to put a site on it, but I would like to use the name and if anybody wanted to email us there, they could do that with this forward. So I'm going to click on Setup, and now it says that it may take several minutes for the product to become active in my account. Okay, I've gone back to my original account login and I'm going to click over here on domain names and then my domain names. And here's the list of all the domain names that I have on this account. I'm going to scroll down to minnesotainsurancesolutions.com and I'm going to go over here to the right and click on manage. Next, I'm going to click over here on the right again, next to MinnesotaInsuranceSolutions.com, and click Add. And this email, I'm going to just type in info at MinnesotaInsuranceSolutions.com. All right, you could type in anything that you wanted there, and I'm going to forward it to our minnesotainsurance.com. So I'm going to type in info, and the one I'm going to be forwarding is info at minnesotainsurancesolutions.com, and I'm going to send it to info at minnesotainsurance.com. If I wanted to forward it to another email address, I would simply put in a comma and then enter in the next email address there, but I'm not going to do that here. And also, I do want to make this a catch all mailbox. And what that means is if somebody were to email anything at minnesotainsurancesolutions.com, this email would catch it and then it would forward on to me. So if somebody sent it to Julie at minnesotainsurancesolutions.com or Gary at or team at or whatever. So this is a catch-all. Let me go ahead and click OK. And now it is pending setup. You can see the other one is active that I had done. So that is all, that's all there is to it, and um, it should become active for you, okay? Thank you. Bye-bye.